All right, here's a quick story time before I go back. I only have 30 minutes, so I have to speak pretty fast. So I went to this office not too long ago, and the patient, one of the patients, didn't like the fact that they had to see somebody new. So as soon as I went to go get them, I was like, hi, how are you? My name is Karen. I'll be your hygienist today. She's sitting down like, she's just so not enthusiastic of seeing someone new. Like, you expect this person, but you are seeing a brand new face. You don't know what to expect, which I get, but there's no reason for you to be mad at me because I showed up for you. I showed up to take care of you. The person who you're looking for, the person you should be mad at, the person you should be giving attitude to when they come back, is the person that's not here. Like, I'm here to help you out. So, bet. I was like, okay, cool. I got her, and then I got her into the room. And then I was like, hi, how are you? My name is Karine. I'll be your hygienist today. Blah, blah, blah. And she's like, where's so-and-so? I was like, uh, so-and-so? I don't even know who so-and-so is. I'm just here to help out. And even, like, that was my, that was, like, my first cue. That was, like, my first, um response to her to let her know that like it's not my fault that the person's not here the person's not here and i came here to help you out so what's going on or your anger issues you need to give it to that person i started like working in their mouth right um cleaning their teeth and they're like you know it's just so frustrating let me show you so they're like you know i'm just so frustrated because you know um when you expect this person and that person to do to do x y and z in your mouth and they're just not i'm sitting up like yeah i know it's very frustrating but you know who we should be mad at right now so and so because i showed up today to help out and that they're not here i think you're you know i know you're mad right now you're angry i think you should take it out on that person like when you see them tell them how angry you are mind you this person took a vacation because it was their birthday so people are not allowed to like dental professionals or healthcare professionals are not allowed to have a vacation or a birthday or take a break if they need to like people need a break like Unless if you had a bad experience, which she didn't. I, I was shocked. I thought she was going to be like, no, I don't like the cleaning. Because somebody walked in and asked her how she doing. And then she was just like, oh my God, this cleaning is great. Okay. It is. Yeah, it was good. Because I, I, I do a thorough job. And she was like, yeah. She, yeah, she was complimenting me about how thorough uh, cleaning. But the thing is, I don't need your negativity beforehand. Like, especially if you're going to leave happy. Like, your negativity kind of like... Yeah, it does affect people's mental health a little bit. You know what I mean? Like, it, it doesn't linger, but it does. I think that's why a lot of people don't like dentistry to begin with. Like, I was warned. I still love this career. But, like, people's negativity and negative energy. <laughs> like, if you don't have thick skin, <laughs> just watch 